like this is the future. Like this is not, they're, they're not just doing this to try to get richer, even though they technically are because Netflix is buying this. Think how much times have changed in 10 years with what we, you know, consume watching, the way we listen to stuff. I'll tell you the last time I watched either linear television or listened to something that wasn't on demand like a podcast. No, I mean, yeah. that's just if you're 40 or below, I'm, sh I'm assuming that's pretty much all you do. We're just not going back. You, you have to look forward in the NFL, I think is trying to strike that balance. But, you know, forever, these owners, most of their wealth obviously has come from the, the growth of the equity in their team. But the money that they received, a large percentage of it is from the TV networks. So Jerry Jones, the Morrow family, Rooney family, like a large percentage of their revenue and cash flow comes from the loyalty of the money CBS, Fox, NBC, and ABC has paid them. Well, now a lot of those guys are super old, either in their late 70s or their 80s, or are dying off. And their children, like my parents were very, very loyal. If you were doing, uh, like they had the same person, a landscaper for 35 years, and whether they did a bad job or a good job, he was never going away. If someone was gonna do, if we were gonna redo tile in a bathroom, it was gonna be the same family friend. I'm just not the same. I, I'll just go, I'll have seven quotes, I'll get the lowest price, and if it's not working out, I'll change. And I think their children represent that. And they are just realizing, like, let's face it, Amazon and Netflix, and if Apple TV wanted to get involved, they just have way more money than these broadcast partners. And these broadcast partners have a lot of money. I mean, they're paying billions of dollars every year. But if Netflix wants to 5X in a bid, just to be like, we'll just take the entire NFL, they can.